if you need help building your team or selling your coins make sure you head on over to cheapmaticcoins.com for the cheapest prices fast delivery and 24-hour customer support and use code wolf for 15 percent off in today's video i'm going to show you guys two run plays to counter two certain run defense actually like three certain run defenses from the three four odd now if you guys don't know three four odd is the primary meta run stopping defense in madden 20 but there are plays that just take advantage of its weakness before we get into today's video man make sure you guys drop a like subscribe to the channel for more content become a member of the wolfpack link is in the description now you're going to be facing people online that like to run the three four odd they're going to run pinch buck run cover four they're going to blitz heavy on you right that's just the way people they want to put your back against the wall now a lot of people fail whenever they face this type of defense this type of pressure you don't know what to do you're like man i can't i can't do nothing it's because you just don't know you don't have the know-how bro and i'm gonna i'm gonna give you guys the know-how now what you're gonna do here is we're gonna be in the what did i just do we're gonna be in the miami dolphins playbook let me come back out to uh choose play you're gonna be we're gonna be in the miami dolphins playbook but you can use the same concept in your playbook or whatever you're using okay so right here what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna come to the i form slot and i'm gonna put in my audibles the stretch alert bubble stretch alert bubble and I'm gonna go through the significance of this run play and how we're gonna set this up. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the Y off and over here, we're gonna take this play out and we're gonna put what's called the 9-5 Willy. I don't know if it's in other playbooks, but I know it is really good in this one. I'm telling you, for pros that are running the Dolphins playbook, bro, add this to your arsenal. Trust me, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show even you guys how to run this, okay? So we're not gonna start in these formations. What we're gonna start off in is the split close Miami. Now, in this audible, I have the mesh, the power O, the wide receiver corners, the PAY shot. Now, I'll probably start the game off with power O just to get a feel. So power O, I'll come out with, and then it's gonna tell me what my opponent's doing. Like he's gonna be, okay, he's running three, four pinch buck, or he's running three, four cover four. That probably is gonna be his base defense and what he bases his whole thing on. So that's gonna tell me a lot. So what I'll do is I'll just come out and like, x drag right i'll come out on that and then you'll see your opponent come out like in pinch but let's say you already know okay this is probably going to be pinch pinch mike pinch buck one of these defenses now you can attack this by passing right zig routes corner routes because what you're going to see is you're going to see this right here they're going to press they're going to shade over the top they're going to blitz all linebackers boom okay now you have two options you can max protect and try to beat it that way or you could take advantage of it being a 3-4 defense. Like I said, there are plays in here that take advantage. So if you see pinch buck, you can audible down to the i form slot and run stretch, okay? Now check this out. This is what I mean. If your opponent does not base the line or try to fix his defense, you just take stretch to the right, okay? Against this defense. Now I should probably put like Homer or Penny in uh, the depth chart because they're faster. Uh, but when you see this, right, if they press, our thing is we want them to not press okay so whenever they press it's good for you in the run game aspect of madden 20. when they back off now you can pass you get what i'm trying to tell you guys when they try to press you like this you need to think in your mind oh i, I could run on this and that's exactly what you do you know what i'm saying you come down to your audibles and you come to the stretch now the stretch one is very good for the pinch buck very good for the pinch buck um and then you just quick hike it once you're able to quick hike it you just quick hike it you take off down the right side of the field and get your yards now if you're using a custom playbook i don't know if you can audible down into the strong h wing maybe i don't know so that's something you need to look out for now another play in this arsenal may not be good against the pinch buck or it may i i haven't tried i know it works against cover four and that's what we're going to talk about next but it's going to be the nine five willie now this play is really good against edge blitz as well so if someone's running three four odd edge blitz this play right here works really well all you have to do is motion this guy over right here okay and then snap the ball i don't know how it does against pitch buck okay so it does really well against pitch buck now the problem that i'm seeing is that marshawn lynch he's too big of a running back and like he gets you know he gets tripped up really easy so if someone's running pinch buck and they're running this variation where they bring everybody in right you can start off and split close miami you can max tech however you want to beat it in the past game but this is madden 20 you were punished for passing okay just understand that in your mind first that you are punished for passing in this game 
So just audible down. You can audible down to the 9-5 Willie. I'm telling you guys, the 9-5 Willie is a play that you need to start running. Just do it like I'm telling you. Motion this guy over. Boom. And you just take off up the field. Another TD. You see what I'm saying? That's another touchdown from the 9-5 Willie. So if they blitz all linebackers from a cover two, right, then you can just throw the B route. Boom, against the cover two. So you see the counters, the counters. Everything has a counter. So you can still pick the stretch alert against the cover two and then throw the bubble against cover two. T cover two, for the most part, like 80%, is going to be successful against cover two defense. So you're seeing that we have an answer within our audibles for everything that the 3-4 the odd can throw us. Now, if we do select like the cover four drop, you can run dive against it depending on how the linebackers look. Let me explain to you guys really quick. So if they pick cover four drop, you're going to start off in the same Miami. You can go to X drag. And then what you're going to see a lot of is this. Now, before I get into the run play part of it, right, I'm going to just show you guys really quick. Baseline, show blitz. They're going to blitz everybody. Okay. Now, there's different ways to attack that. I'll do it in another video, but... Don't forget that you have in routes, bro, okay? So if someone's consistently running cover four, you max protect, motion out Metcalf, put him on an in route, okay? And run it this way. Put X on a streak. Boom, against these, these defenses right here. These types of routes are gonna just annihilate cover four in an all-out blitz. Now, I run the cover four all-out blitz, and I'm gonna let you throw the in route. Once I, once I think that you've done it too much, then I'll put the soft squats and stuff like that in position. But until you realize in your mind that you can throw an in route on that or a quick out route, you can even do it from this side. Look, okay? You can do it from this side. All you're going to do is you're going to take uh, Metcalf, put him on a streak, X on an out route, max protect, okay? So it's going to look like this, right? And you can just throw this, quick out routes, okay? The best players do this. You're not looking for deep passes. When someone's all out blitzing, you're not looking for deep passes. You're looking for the quick route that gets you a lot of yards, and that's what it is. That's what you're going to be doing right there. So don't forget that you can do that. But back to the run. They all out blitz. Now, in this position, I don't know if, if they have the linebackers in the gaps, right? Um, you probably want to be running the 9-5 willy the, the way I told you. And then some people swear by ID and the outside guy is going to help you better. Even slide protecting to that side. Boom. He, he got off the shed really quick. But what I would recommend you do, if you're facing someone that puts these linebackers in the gap like that, I want you to come to the strong pro and just run dive. All right? Just run dive. Now, there's going to be chance. This is Madden 20. There's going to be times where you get stopped at the line, but then there's going to be times where you break for a touchdown against this type of setup. And I'm going to show you what I mean. I, I need to get Lynch out of there, bro, because he's he's primarily the reason. He's a good running back, but for Madden and what we're trying to do, he's not. So let's just put in this position, we're going to put Penny for now, okay? And we're going to come out in the same formation because we want to get the same look. Or you could just come out in that formation. It doesn't matter. However you want to play it, but that's how I'm going to play it. So if someone brings their linebackers into the line in 3-4, run the dives, bro. You're, I mean, you're not always going to, to, to hit big. But if you see my gameplays, I do hit big, right? I score like back-to-back -back touchdowns and stuff like that. So right here, all you got to do, did he not substitute? Oh, okay, because I'm starting in, my bad. That's my fault. That's my fault. So like this, okay? And you just take chances on your dive. Okay, it's like a, it's, it's a, it's a, like it's a dice roll. You see what I'm saying? It's a dice roll. This is... This is Madden. This is like RNG, bro. It's it's a dice roll. It's eventually going to happen. So if they bring linebackers down into the line, as you're seeing right there, right? It's a dice roll. You just come and you you run a dive straight through the middle. You see there's nobody in the middle, especially if the user's not in the middle. He's playing one of the blues. Then you just take, try to, you know, you take your chances with a dice roll. Now, if you have to pass and he's running that, then you can just, right? You can just use your out routes. I mean, your in routes. Use in routes out routes however you want to do it you got you got to get them yards boom get your yards bro you know what i'm saying attack attack another way you can attack it is this way okay say he does all out blitz right streak x streak a streak rb streak y okay and then put what beyond well actually put beyond an out route okay 
So this is how you're gonna attack it. What you do is you identify, you try to identify what side the user on. Let's say the user's over here, right? You see him moving around. He's gonna follow the X route because he's gonna get burned on a streak. So that's gonna be his, his guy, right? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna identify the user. We're gonna throw opposite to our running back. So all out blitz, boom, everybody's coming in. RB, boom. If he's on the right side, you throw it left. If he's on the left side, you throw it right. But the strong H wing stretch is still the best run play for cover four. So if someone just wants to run cover four defense, you take the runs outside because the run fits in cover four drop go inside. They can't stop outside runs especially if you use overpowered runs like the strong h wing use the single back wing tight z use that stretch play stretches cover four can't stop them there's it's hard to stop bro now people running that edge blitz one time one more time before we get off this video if someone's running the three four edge blitz you can still run that play i'm gonna say it's a little bit better against the edge blitz than it is cover four drop uh so we're just gonna run it from from the the actual formation the y off and then we're gonna go nine five willie and then we're gonna blitz all linebackers, spread linebackers, crash everybody. How you know, just typical setups. Now, what's cool about this is even though it's man defense, this guy acts like he's gonna follow and he goes back. And that's what you want right there. Right? And this is gonna open up everything. Like I said, my my stick game is horrible, but you're gonna break. You see the you see what's gonna happen in this play. You already see it. We shade over the top. Okay. I'm actually gonna man him up to the running back. That way he takes off for him because trying to use two controllers is very hard, homies. Bring this guy over here. And this is gonna be a good run. You see what I'm saying? You break free, it's over. It's over. So I just wanted to share those with you guys. I'm gonna show you guys how to pass against heavy blitzing, pinch buck, and cover four in future videos. So stay tuned for that. Uh, make sure you drop a like, subscribe to the channel for more content. Love you guys, man. Peace.